Egypt in the women's bracket joining the party for the first time and they're going to be playing against the team of Algeria. This comes off a loss. And they're going to want, obviously, to take care of business, the defending chance. Looking for conquest once again. We finished undefeated last year, 5 0 record. And obviously, you want to keep an eye out for the spectacular play of Soraya Mohammed, but she's not alone. He is not. Salawi, the first bucket in Salawi, always provides a nice offensive boost for Team Egypt. The grand favorite of this competition, and look at this move from Ranim El Gadami. Going to work, Algeria is going to be in trouble. We already knew that. Can they re can they battle? Can they respond? Fast break city in the corner. Now the wide open shot. Mohammed did not close out. Did not believe that Taibu could make it. Miss Lay Layup El Gadami. Falling dessert. That looked easy. But in the end, you still gotta do it. Catch and shoot. Up to Mark Kitty. Algeria lost 10 6 against Uganda. Ooh, the Hesdi going the other way. Finishing. That was smooth. Soraya left her defender in the dust. Three zip. And that's a good shot right there.
Ball moving, an open look. Going right back at it. First one looked better than the second. Wide open. Mohamed Nolugai with the backdoor cut from Nurad Ali. Oh, yes. Uh oh. What was that? Did she just fake Ali out of her shoes? I don't know. That looked good. After that, you can't be two people on the ball. Nurala Ali said, look, I might have almost fall down, but I'm going to get that bucket on you to make up for it. 9-4. Obviously, the size advantage for Team Egypt between uh, Al Gadami and Ali. We got the size. And the size translates to offensive rebounds. Nogadami, the travel of the transition. Enforced error. And the Egyptian fans need some voice. A lot of holding. Raya Muhammad going to foul. Ryan Mohammed, bang, bang, bang. Could even say swish it is swish. Burning the net, 12-4. Things are not looking too good for Team Algeria. Gadami draws the foul. And we'll go to the free throw line. Team four, the lead increasing at a great pace. Already 13 points scored, not even halfway done with this game. In action, good footwork right back at you, Nadine Salawi. And it's not 141, <laughs> it is 14, but it feels like 141 right now for Algeria. Going twice, going three times, and this time around with Taibi. It goes. Ryan Mohammed, no look. Once again, good full work, and that's going to be a foul drawn and one free throw. Ryan Mohammed telling Nadine Salawi, got the extra pass at the top. Renine is open. He's like, well. Oh. Open she is, but I was in the paint. I could get the bucket. 15-5. Wide open. She's going to pull that up. Ryan Mohammed. Patient with it. No look again on the back door. The ball got deflected. Going to be, I believe, four seconds left on the 12-second shot clock. And yes, it is. Gonna have to play. They're playing inside mismatch city. There was nothing that Buzena could do with that matchup. El Gadami, too tall, too strong, too good. 16-5. There's no questions that we can uh, anticipate Egypt finishing in 21 points. The question is, how fast will they do that? Algeria outmatched.
Mohammed. She got a lot of space. She finds inside. The mismatch looks easy, doesn't it? Rala Ali bumps the lead up to 12. And that's going to be a wide open look. She takes her sweet time and she just throws up an airplane. Zena gives it back. Miss shot. And shoot it again. Ooh, the deadly cross jab. Mohammed misses. And that's going to be right before the expiration of the 12 second shot clock. El Gadami brings Egypt within three points of the 21 point win. Mohammed no look pass. Beautiful. Going once, going twice. The answer is no. Ali, not enough lift on that. Zena, mid range. Checking it up. Off the mark. Nice long pass. Easy bucket. Renin Al Gadami. Almost 6 3. So he's Nurala Ali. So 19 5. A bucket here. Mohammed elected to go with the drive and mid range for Ali. There you go. Enough. Another one. Long range. Mohammed misses. And the block. The defense by Ogadami. Ogadami will take it. Misses, though. Brian Mohammed not playing defense on that one at all. Give and go. Good job. 20 to 10. And the block. Easy. Of the dummy. You don't have to try hard with the shot attempt from Amel Buzena. So we already know who's going to finish third in the group. It's going to be Algeria. We're going to have a nice opposition between Uganda and Egypt for top seed out of pool A later on today. Going for 22. Mohammed misses. Block the defense. Malawi said, let's finish this now. Game over. 21-10. Egypt dominates Algeria. Coming up next, it'll be Madagascar against Kenya.